They're a bully. The IRS is a bully. And they're, they're a bully that is pushing around a young, you know, a mom trying to make her way in a recession with a, a small business and one employee, which is her. Um, and they're not making an attempt to try to work with her. They're not making an attempt to try to resolve the problem in a way that would be beneficial to the taxpayer, to her small business. They're, they're abusing their power and acting recklessly, um, ignoring her attorney, not responding to correspondence. Uh, there's plenty of letters that we have where we've written um, the revenue agent saying, will you please respond to our letters? Will you please answer my phone calls? Will you please stop contacting my client directly well, I mean, a bully is, in my opinion, someone that has um, some power that they uh, abuse. And here, the, the power given to the government to collect taxes is broad. It, it's, a, it's the envy of a lot of debt collectors. Um, there are a whole myriad of instruments, of tools, of weapons at their disposal that really don't require a lot of the same due process. They don't require a lot of the same safeguards. And I think there's probably an assumption in that regard that the IRS internally in their administration of their laws that they might, you know, monitor their conduct to ensure that they're not in fact taking money from a taxpayer who doesn't owe the tax. And after reviewing the returns and after two years of asking the people at the IRS involved in this where the liability exists against which the, the levy was applied, we have never been told.